Western New York moms helping other moms in a really unique way. Does it get any better than this? I don't think it gets better than this. <laughs> you have your two babies, life is good. Heather and Elizabeth welcomed preemie babies at Sisters Hospital less than three months ago. Today, they are back, babies in tow, to drop off breast milk. When the twins were born, I was worried about having enough milk just for the two of them. So we were like praying for a double portion of milk. And then I got so much milk that I realized I had enough to feed like the whole NICU. <laughs> Even though these moms both delivered early, Heather delivering twins at 27 weeks, Elizabeth delivering a daughter at 30 weeks, their bodies are producing enough milk for their babies and then some. And thanks to the New York Milk Bank, none of that milk will go to waste. If I hadn't been able to pump milk, I would have really wanted her to be able to have human milk because I, I believe that's the best for her. You know, science shows that that's the best for babies. And the New York Milk Bank is hoping other moms with enough milk will feel the same. The state's bank opened just about a year ago. To be a donor, these moms had to go through some routine health checks and then were given a donor number. They can then pump at home and donate to any of the drop-off sites, like Sisters, whenever they have enough stored up. There are illnesses that can be life or death for these children, and human milk coats that baby's belly and gives them all the antibodies they need to help prevent this illness from happening. Up until the New York Milk Bank opened last year, any milk donated from moms was sent out of state. Now it stays right here in New York. Gina Harmon, the hospital's lactation coordinator, says she sees the need for milk firsthand, especially in the hospital's NICU. Plus, there is a unique need for breast milk from these moms of preemies. The beautiful thing about that is breast milk is always changing. So instead of a mom maybe that has a baby that's one years old her milk is different than these girls that have babies that are six weeks old if it can't be milk from the biological mom Harmon says the next best thing is milk from another mom in buffalo stephanie barnes channel 2 news what a great gift it sounds like a great idea still ahead on daybreak patrick's back with the check of the seven day forecast and also another live report from Kevin O'Neill, who's up in Amherst this morning at the Buffalo Niagara Heritage Village, showing us something new. We'll be right back.